your eyes and just Jesus, imagine him place, that you're right before him Jesus, oh, Yeshua. oh how we worship you and honor you you are so beautiful you are so worthy you are so lovely you are so powerful and kind you are so faithful you shed your blood, your innocent blood, Yeshua, that we are in covenant together. And the fulfillment of that covenant is upon our lives of health, wholeness, preservation, rescue. long life oh such grace and your wonderful mercy in this time that we're in Yeshua those that think they can redefine and rename and, can, and those that think they can stand in injustice there is a shaking well-known mountain shall surprise many in the earth as it blows its top why that the things that have been deep and hidden below shall explode suddenly to the top for all to see as masks are removed and curtains pulled but the guilty will be brought to justice righteousness and justice are the foundation of thy throne We are to say not that it is not coming. Like the widow in a time of injustice of a judge who feared not God nor had regard to man. Yet her persistence and importunity caused righteousness justice speedily being avenged of enemies and so God speaks to us and say and says persist press press for my justice press for my righteousness to manifest it's the key to acceleration of being avenged speedily from your adversaries. Oh, Yeshua, we worship you. Oh, how we love you and honor you. There is a shaking The walls will come down There is a shaking The strong men will be bound There is a shaking Walls will come down There is a shaking The strong men will be bound There is a shaking 
walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound there is a shaking the walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound there is a shaking the walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound there is a shaking the walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound there is a shaking the walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound there is a shaking the walls will the walls will come down there is a shaking the strong men will be bound The walls, the walls will come down. There is a shaking. The strong men, strong men will be bound. There is a shaking. There is a shaking. The walls will come down. There is a shaking. The strong men. Will Give him a shout, his walls. We shout unto God with a voice of triumph. His walls are coming down. Shaking, set me go. Therefore, there shall be great shakings that shall arise at this time. Look to the places of these shaking, says the Spirit of God, for they will be in places where they say that there is not usually seismic activity or even fault lines. But this is not what I look at by way of fault lines. I look at those who are at fault and what they have done, says the Spirit of God, and tunnels that are under the earth's soil that have led to much regarding children that must now come to the surface and be exposed as the Spirit of God. There shall be great activity upon the earth and the shakings of the soil and even in the places of deep waters. Why does the earth shake in the place of deep waters? Because there are those of the deep state that are in deep water with my justice, says the Spirit of grace. And this will be a sign unto the earth that justice and righteousness is increasing. But watch, watch, for there will be great winds. There will be much activity in the atmosphere and you will say, what is this by way of winds? They will scream and say, Cat 5, but it is not my hand. God says, yet there are those that must arise at that time to show the power that I have given in the earth to speak to the wind and to the sea. But yet there will be great displays of lightning. And they will say, these are but record, record, record by way of the length and the height of these bolts that 
shall strike and shall be displayed and some shall not even they will look and say where did it strike but the displays that I show shall be my justice that is striking down the attacks and the efforts of he who sits in the high places of the earth and thinks that he can control as the prince of the power of the air. Not so, I laugh. And I will show the displays of my lightning, but watch. There shall be shakings of the very atmosphere of the heavenlies where many demonic thrones and high places are. Listen, I will give you a sign for you will hear my voice. And it will be the sound of thunder that will shake your windows, shake the very ground beneath. And they will say, what is this with the thunderous noise that is coming from the sky? God says, listen to me. You are about to see justice and righteousness that does not just affect those of you in the earth. But that which has been in the heavens, the strongholds, they are falling, says the living God, that I may reset the earth and I may bring divine reversals to give the generation of the children. God says, a revolution of light. Come on, shout. Shout. The walls will come down. There is a shaking. The strong men will be bound. There is a shaking. The walls will come down. There is a shaking. The strong men will be bound. There is a shaking. The walls will come down. There is a shaking. Strong men will be bound. There is a shaking. The walls will come down. There is a shaking. I want you to say with me, say, Lord God, be it done according to your word. We come into agreement with your word, with righteousness and your justice. Let everything that can be shaken be shaken now in the name of Yeshua thank you Lord now come on give him one last big praise this is why we need to be here next week where I think I am going to preach on prophetic sounds just before the album comes you know that there are two distinct voices of Jesus and we'll talk about that next week do you know that when Jesus speaks there's two specific sounds that he releases and one of them has to do with what you just did here you want me to give you a hint now nah, just wait till next week I'll give you one I'll, I'll, I'll just tell you we'll, we'll teach on it next week the Bible says in the book of Revelation chapter 1 in verses 10 through 15 15 that the voice of the Lord the Apostle John sees Jesus and he hears a great voice and it's the voice of Jesus the Alpha and the Omega and he says this is the voice of a trumpet and so how many of you know the prophetic and trumpets go together we'll talk about that that's why the devil hates 45 because there's a trumpet sound in him that evangelical religious people think he's too gruff the second one is he hears another voice, same Jesus, and it's the voice of many waters. And the many waters is the corporate sound of the church that releases something out of their belly. What did Jesus say? Out of your belly shall flow what? Rivers of living water. And when you are a prophetic people like this, you don't worry about time. You don't worry about, you know, that we're you know trying to be evangelical religious you know make sure that we you know meet your expectation of what you think a church service is those of us that understand Jesus he will 
tap into our deep. The Bible says the deep calls unto the deep. He'll speak to us. And he wants the sound of many waters. What is that? Spirit-filled people releasing a prophetic sound like we are doing. Because God does nothing in the earth unless he reveals an aid to his prophets. But also, it has to be by people. Acts 2. There had to come a sound first from the earth of a praying people. Then there came a sound from heaven. How many of you understand? So we'll talk about that next week. I want you to go ahead. And, I don't know. I don't, anyway, that's just a side note. But why don't you go ahead and be seated. We're going to receive Holy Communion. And I want to talk to you in just a moment. You know what? Let's not. Let's just do this. Ushers, just go ahead and begin to serve the